Hi and welcome, thanks for watching. Just want to share with you today uh, the parcel that arrived in the mail. I've been eagerly anticipating this delivery. I'm um, currently building the 1700 scale USS John F. Kennedy, uh, I believe a Kitty Hawk class aircraft carrier. Uh, within the kit does come some reasonably good aircraft in clear plastic parts. Uh, detail is, is fine, there's nothing wrong with them. However, I find that with my big fat clumsy hands and I do tend to get the shakes a little bit on these smaller scale projects. Um, these are a little difficult, especially the, the tail sections and the landing gear uh, didn't quite come together right for me. Landing gear was a little chunky. Uh, it was difficult for me to get the, the, the tail sections onto the aircraft in a nice symmetrical manner. Uh, and when you line them up on the back of the deck, uh, it, it just didn't look the part and um, I was hoping to find a, a solution uh, to, to this and did come across on the internet um, Shapeways all the way from New York. Um, I've been waiting over a month for this parcel and just wanted to share the, uh, the box opening with you and we'll see what we've got inside here. Shapeways is 3D modeling. They've got some really interesting subject matter on their website. And I'm hoping that um, the detail of some of these 3D printed aircraft might be a bit more suitable for uh, the 1700 scale, which um, you know I'm by no means a professional model. I'm far from it. I just sit here in my garage and, and, and kit bash in my time out for some uh, peace of mind. Um, this is just another example of one of the kit supplied aircraft here. Um, I've cut the wing sections up and had it in the stowed position. Um, yeah, the landing gears, you know, it, it's all uneven and wonky and when it sits on the deck, uh, you don't get that nice symmetrical look of, of aircraft all lined up. So inside the box, we've got some two nicely wrapped aircraft, I'm hoping inside a Ziploc bag. So I've ordered two types of aircraft here and in this first bag we should hopefully see uh, some FA-18D model Super Hornets or F, I'm sorry, can't recall. Correct me if I'm wrong. Um, wow. I am impressed. So these are all one piece. Uh, the landing gear is fully detailed. I've got a combination of uh, Hornets here. Let's see, we've got three, six, nine. We've got 12 Hornets here in total. Um, they come fully equipped with, looks like we've got some um, uh, missiles and some fuel tanks. And I don't know if I can, you can get a good view of that. I'll have to cut some off the sprues and do a second review after this inbox and, and give you a better look. But um, some of these Hornets come with their wings in the stowed position and some fully extended. So first impressions, um, I'm quite impressed. The second lot of aircraft I ordered are some F-14 Tomcats. Now, I believe these were the D models, but they, uh, two, four, six, eight, we have eight of these. And they've all got their, oh no, there's uh, one, two, three, four, five, six, seven of them with their wings in the swept back position. And one with the wings out, which uh, I guess can be um, modeled in the takeoff position. So the detail is, is quite crisp. It's actually quite impressive. I can see missiles on the underside of the wing pylons. Um, these appear to be quite delicate. I think I've already broken off a, a wheel off one of them. Um, but I'm quite impressed by the way these, these look. Um, there is a whole catalog of aircraft on this uh, Shapeways website. Um, anywhere from 1 700th scale, which I'm building, um, up to 1 350 for some of the larger ships. Um, and they could be well worth considering as a substitute for 
uh, kit provided aircraft if you do struggle with construction like I do. All in all, these are looking pretty good and I do look forward to getting them off the sprue, spraying them up, detailing them and having them sit on the deck. Uh, stay posted, I'll probably put up another video uh, in the next day or so once I have them cut off the sprues, cleaned up, uh, give them a coat of primer and, and see how they come up.